Good morning, hot dogs. Welcome to the morning announcements. It's finally Friday. Sports, weather, after school tutoring, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. A reminder that tutoring begins next week, the 14th of September, from 3 to 4.15, only Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays. They will also be providing transport to get you right home. This year's uh, Audrey's Pumpkin and Garment Cake Roll fundraiser kicked off on Thursday, September 9th, and ends on Tuesday, September 21st. DECA members are selling 13 different flavor of cake rolls. Each cake roll serves between 10 to, 20, 10 to 12 people. Baked frozen cake rolls will arrive in early November in time for Thanksgiving and Christmas. Members will individually benefit from each cake roll sold. Cake rolls are $19 each. This week is Suicide Prevention Week and we want to share the reasons we stay. Every person has something that gives their life purpose, whether it's a person, sport, food, music, activity, or goal. FHS students, share yours on social media using hashtag FHS Reasons I Stay for a chance to win a prize. Now to weather and sports. Finally, it is Friday. Today you can expect another cold day. As you can tell, this morning it was freezing, with the temperatures being 52 degrees. The high for today will only be 77 degrees. As we roll into the night, the temperature will drop down to the low 60s. For the weekend, you can expect a big change. On Saturday, the temperature will swell into the 80s in the afternoon. And on Sunday, the temperature will continue to rise all the way into the 90s. This weekend, you can expect some wind with it being projected to be over 10 miles per hour through Saturday and Sunday. That's all for the weather. Now to Sports with Elijah. Thanks, David. On Wednesday night, the Frankfurt volleyball team played Lebanon here in Case Arena. The score is in the first set, 8-25, Lebanon, second set, 15-25, also Lebanon, in the third and final set of the game, 25-21, Lebanon, with a 3-0 win. That's it for volleyball. Now to soccer. Last night, the Frankfurt Hot Dogs traveled to Crawfordsville in conference play. As part of Crawfordsville Senior Night, the Hot Dogs can continue their streak of playing extremely well to four straight games. This excellent play would see the Hot Dogs to a tied score at the end of regulation. And the foul man of the first overtime and a first unfortunate bounce on a Crawfordsville corner kick resulted in the only goal of the match as Frankfurt was unable to come up with an equalizing goal in the second overtime. Frankfurt falls 4-4 four four on season and 2-1 conference play. Frankfurt next plays at home on Tuesday against conference row. Sethmont kickoff is at 6 p.m. The Frankfurt boys JV soccer team also traveled Crawfords the last night. The Hot Dogs played well with standout of the night being Marcelino Cervantes and Mario Weber, his name is. Despite Frankfurt's best effort, the Hosting Athenians went home with the victory 5-0. Aiden Hudspeth won the point for the Hot Dogs at two singles. Aiden has made close and long matches this season and has fallen short. Last night, he was rewarded with a win. Aiden was patient and made adjustments to his game as it progressed. Aiden's ability to stay calm and focus currently has helped him build his tennis game. Good job, Aiden. Reminder, JV football game will not be, will not be Saturday. It will be Monday, so go out and support. Hot Dog fan tickets for a Southmont football game may be purchased in two ways. You can use the following link, which can be found on the Athletic website, or you can use a debit or credit card you can purchase at the gate. Cash purchases for tickets will not be available at the gate tonight. See you there, and go hot dogs. That's it for sports. Thank you, guys. Happy birthdays go out to Carmen Campbell, Lisbeth Corteras, Xander Flores, Eric Linka, and Iris Madera. The Hispanic Heritage Festival will be September 18th on Saturday from 4 to 10 p.m. Located at the Perry Creek Park on the Farmers Bank Stage. Habrá pasarle pasarela de trajes regionales, presentaciones de comida mexicana, recon reconocimiento y lectura del ensayo ganador de los jóvenes de la pre preparatoria, exposición de arte de los jóvenes de la secundaria y más actividades para los niños. 
That's all for today's announcements. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe.